USA Cares provides financial assistance to military veterans and service members all across the United States. One of their newer programs that serves homeless vets is in need of your support. We have President and CEO of USA Cares, Trace Chesser, stopping by to tell us more about that. Always great to see you. Thank you so much for having me. It has to be a really, I think every season is busy for you. It's very busy. Yeah. All and, the time. And, and uh, let's talk a little bit about this Homeless Veterans Reintegration Program. What is it and how long have you had it at USA Cares? So we've been doing it over the past year and it's something that's really taken off. We've started to get a lot of partners that want to work with us, that want to help bring veterans to us that we can take and coach them, train them and put them to work. Right. And so that's been something we want to find more because I will tell you, honestly, we have way more employers yeah. who want to hire veterans than we actually have veterans. Mm -hmm. And also it, it takes you all having kind of an infrastructure in place for training, yes. right? Like what happens yep. in the interim? How do you identify a veteran that you know this would be a great candidate for our program? And then, and then how do you work with them to find a job that works for them and suits their skill set? Right. So I have a little bit of a talent acquisition background and then I hired some other people that have the same thing. And we've actually, we've been working for about five years to get uh, different programs going with Fort Knox to help those service members that are transitioning out. Now it's not the same thing because mm -hmm. they're usually retiring, they've had a long career with the military. So coaching training and getting them into the workforce is a little bit different. Yeah. But we've developed all these relationships with these employers and helped them out. And so that's been a, a great resource to have. Now transitioning to this program and trying to help those that are at risk of mm -hmm. homelessness or that are homeless, uh, it just, it was a natural fit. And you're looking for referrals. We are. Right. And so how does, how can somebody get in touch with you and, and what do you want them to refer? So we are working with a lot of the shelters in, in town to try to help find those veterans yeah. and help them to work. But what we're also looking for is those that are at risk or maybe they've transitioned and they're living in mom, dad's basement or their brother's couch or whatever. Mm -hmm. You know, they're, they may not be homeless, but they're at risk of it. Yep. We really want to work with them as well. And so anybody who knows them, tell them to email us info at usacares.org. That whole transition is tricky, right? Is. And and you, it's one thing to go and serve our country and then come, you know, firsthand, yeah. right? And that's where you all step in, not only in this way, but in so many ways, the transition is tough. And you know that there can be um, problems all along the way. Yeah. Yeah. It, it really is. I mean, you know, if you think about it, we take a lot of time to take a young person and put them in the military. Yeah. I mean, basic training, school training, training, all these different types of training programs. But then when they're getting out, now the military does a great job with their transition assistance program, so mm -hmm. I'm not knocking that in any way. But just the fact that all of a sudden you've been a part of this major team mm -hmm. and you've been doing this for a few years and then suddenly you come home and there's no structure. There's no, right. I don't have to be anywhere at a certain time. And that could be a little bit challenging mm -hmm. and most have no problem whatsoever. But because of the military and how large it is, you know, you're going to have a pretty significant number of those who do have a little bit of a problem transitioning. And so USA Cares is proud to be able to help them. And if folks can't help on the referral side or with this particular program, you guys are always looking for financial support. People Absolutely. can help in that way too. Yeah, because we primarily, what we're dealing with, stop evictions, stop foreclosures, yeah. turn on utilities and get them food. You're getting all those bills paid. Yeah, yeah. that's it. For a period of time. Uh, and how can people help with that? Do they just need to email you as well? They can go to our website, usacares.org, yeah. and they'll find an area there to give. Uh, we do need a lot of assistance mm -hmm. in that area. Hey, last time you got off the air, somebody called in with, <laughs> they're like, immediately he got off the air and they're like, how can I help? And I'm like, I love that. Yeah. I love that for you all. Great. And we want that help again today. If you or somebody you know can possibly help, we're just so proud of the work that you're doing with our veterans. Thank you so much. Thank you. Always good to see you too, to Trace. You. Thanks so much. So if you'd like to donate or support our veterans and their families in crisis, visit usacares.org.